Hey everybody, so I have realized that I may have followers in other states. While I don't know the level of dedication they would have to the movement, um, to all of my followers, this is what I have to say. If you are wondering how can I help or I can't help because I'm too far away or I can't help because if I, if she needed help with money I can't help well don't don't worry about don't worry about all that um, if, if I need it I'll ask if you can't help that's fine we're all struggling the economy has gone to shit we're all barely scraping by but there is a way that you can help and uh, you you either don't have to spend any money at all or maybe four or five bucks just depending on how you want to go about that so one of my goals is to go national with my police reform movement also uh, a goal of mine is for my story to go national because I can use it to help people in the long run all throughout the United States and possibly even the world I can dream big right um so I have a way that you can help me, and it will help achieve uh, many goals all at once if we can all team up and do something like this. If you support my dogs coming home, if you support reform and, and the message of unity that I've been trying to spread, um, and and if you want to help me get my story to go viral, which is what I've been trying to do, this is what you can do. You can create a sign. And I'll, I'll give you a, something that you can write on it. But ultimately, what you want to write on it is up to you. You can say, War Machine, I stand with you. And you can say, the story of this car must be told, Hendersonville, North Carolina. You can put a sign that says, War Machine, I stand with you and your message of unity, which is what a few people have been saying locally. Actually, that both of those phrases are phrases that locals have started using. And you can uh, create a sign that demands an investigation into the wrongful conviction of War Machine's owner. In Henderson County, North Carolina. And you can create a sign demanding that not only this be investigated, but that um, <clears throat> my dogs need to be returned. Um, I, I do need some help from fellow Americans on getting the movement out there. I don't know how many of you there are, and I am glad for the ones I have. That means that the, the followers I have right now understand that we do have a problem here. We do need more unity. We do need reform. And I appreciate y'all. Even if I've never seen you or never met you, appreciate you. And much love. So if you are wondering, you know how to help me with that that is almost free to do i mean you can grab cardboard box you can grab a neon sign from the dollar tree the, the cardboard paper um and just protest you know outside your local some courthouses don't allow it that just because they don't don't allow it doesn't mean you don't have to protest on the courthouse property where you're not allowed to you can protest close to it so I would say close to a courthouse, close to your local law enforcement. Um, I would say protest wherever you feel that you can protest, that it will grab attention. Maybe a downtown area, maybe a city area. Um, and I'm, I'm not saying make all of those signs at once. I was just giving you some ideas for what to put on the signs. Um, and if you do a protest... Please uh, videotape yourself and your friends if you feel like it. And um, contact me on my YouTube or my TikTok. 
and maybe we can work out a way to uh, get that up on my channels as well. Um, you do not have to record it. Uh, it would just be good to have it to show that the movement is growing. And so there's an idea. Um, this, uh, the, the meme that I made out of this picture is one of the very many reasons that they were service animals to begin with. And in case you haven't viewed a lot of my tribute videos to my dogs, what I'm doing is I'm showing that this is the, the result of removing a service animal from doing its job, which is actually a felony. And I do believe the officers involved do need to be charged with that. And in that sense, and many others, that qualified immunity is complete and utter bullshit. Because cops have been using it to get away with crimes for a very long time. Which is why we the people are sick of qualified immunity. But um, if, if you've seen how depressing my tribute videos are. That is me literally having no qualms with showing the public the direct consequences of removing a service animal from doing their job. Because all of those negative depression-like feelings were barely, like, they practically didn't exist while I had my dogs, which was one of the many reasons I had them. They helped me to function. I can hide it well, but I'm barely functioning at all. I was doing a lot better when I had my service animals with me. Now I have a hard time with a lot of things. So, me being autistic, one of those things is being social. While I am always happy to tell anybody with two ears my story, and I usually do, sometimes I recede and become reclusive and just don't leave my car, you know, uh, well, unless I have to eat or whatever. You know, the regular shit. So, um, this is one of the ways that you can help me. And you don't have to come to North Carolina. You don't have to come to Henderson County to protest. You can do it in your own town and state. And it would be really awesome if, uh, I saw people getting out there and doing this, um, I see so many stories where people have had a similar issue and they've gotten a lot of public support from the community. So while I do have a lot of support from the community here, um, I think locals are more prone to being scared of retaliation. And that's why a lot of people don't, because a lot of the people that I've encountered have also had problems with Henderson County. You don't really have to commit a crime to have a problem with the police here. It's it's an unfortunate fact, but there's a lot of towns like that, and this is one of them. So if if you are wondering how to help me, you can you can get out and you can protest for my story to be heard, for uh, my wrongful conviction to be investigated, for my dogs to be returned. Um, just a few ideas of what to put on the sign. But uh, anyway, I've been thinking about what I will say in this video when I make it. And I tend to uh, veer off subject a lot because I have ADHD. So I can't think about one thing at a time. I have to think about a million things at a time. And that's also my anxiety. Love y'all. Good night.